Welcome back, this is Yama Jack. We've got ZF, K KF, not ZF, KF, Mountain Pass Z Fix, Suicidal Gunslinger. I just recorded a, uh, an episode on Biolapse, but I had the, uh, the mute backwards the whole time, so every time I would cough or sneeze or sniff or something, I'd, I'd unmute it, and then every time I'd talk, I would mute it, <laughs> so it was backwards the entire time. I didn't realize that until the end when I look over and I'm like, oh crud. That's really unfortunate. <laughs> so, I'm here recording another one. It's okay, it's okay. I enjoy KF2. I don't mind playing a bit of KF2 and it going wrong. I still, it was still a good game. We did die on the uh, third round, I believe. Yeah, third round. Just towards the end, so we got like overrun by husks and scrakes, and that's uh, that one small room with the. They're all kind of small rooms. I don't even know how to describe it. It's uh, you got the stairs to go down and to the trader, and you got the stairs to go up, and then there's like the doorway off to the side, and uh, you got some more stairs to go down to like a little viewing platform thing on the on the tap platform. Um. I don't know if that's a good description of it, but that's that's my description of it. Um, yeah. Anyway, we died there. It's a horrible room to, to play in. That's like the worst room that uh, the Biolapse has, in my opinion. And uh, we died, so what can you expect, right? It's okay. Uh, anyway, so we're, we're here on ZF. Uh, Z, ZF. Zedfix. Z Mountain, KF, whatever. Look, we're on the mountain with the, the airplane. The aeroplane. That's what matters. Sure, we're gonna get a win. Of course, I wanna win. It's actually, uh, it's 11, it's quarter after 11 right now, and it's actually quite cool. Which is nice. Because I could record more. I don't really wanna, because double XP just started in RuneScape, but I'm kinda like. Yeah, maybe we'll get some divination XP, or alternatively, go make some lunch and go pass out for like three or four hours and have a nice nap. Because I didn't get much sleep last night. I stayed up until 3 a.m. training divination in RuneScape. And then uh, I got up at like 7 this morning or 8 this morning. I can't remember. This is just... Why are there... Is this the Gorefiend wave? Are we playing Endless? Um... I'm pretty sure we're playing Endless right now. And Sirens can spawn with Gore Fiends. Um, anyway, so uh, I stayed up till about 3 a.m. It was some divination. So it was a, a party, a, a party of uh, about 1,400 cores. Very, very nice. I did not stay up for all of it. It was going to go on for like another probably three or four hours. And I'm like, I just, I can't stay up for that. I'm tired, I'm going to bed. So it was like 3 a.m. 2 or 3 a.m. And, uh... And boots, then I get up at... You know... 7 or 8 a.m. And it's, uh, it's tired, I'm tired. But, I don't know. I, uh, we're having movers come out today, because we've got my, uh, my grandparents have moves now. So I believe they are actually living at their new place. I believe... They still own their old place, but they have sold it. Uh, they, they, they just haven't actually, like, not all of the process has been done yet, I believe. Um, so they're, uh, they've moved. And, um, so we're, we're taking some of their furniture, some of their old furniture. We got, like, a table and couch and stuff. So some movers are coming out today, I believe. I'm not sure how much of an app I'll be able to get because of that. Um, because they're going to be quite noisy. And you can't not be noisy when you're a mover. Like, you're moving this giant table into somebody's house. Like, it's going to be quite loud. You know? So, um, yeah. Might give it a try, but uh, I'll probably end up being disappointed. That's kind of why I was woken up, actually, I think, because they were getting it ready for the movers, so they were, like, clearing out space for them to put stuff, and then uh, that made, like, a lot of noise, so it woke me up, and then 
It's like, well, I gotta go and record the, uh, I have to record the Amajack tries at least for today. Uh, for yesterday, I guess, from when this video is going live. Or is it today? No, this one would be yesterday, because this one's going up tomorrow morning. Your you know, recording, backlogs, look, it's all, it's all confusing. It confuses me just as much as it confuses you, or pro probably more. Um... Uh, anyway, so I had to record the uh, the Amcheck tries for for yesterday and today. T today and tomorrow, I don't know, man. Look, I had to record two Yamajack tries. I had to record the uh, the one about climbing the hill. I can't remember the name of, and then Synthetic Legion Rising. Synth synth synthetic Legion Rising was a fantastic game. I'm definitely looking forward to having a series on that one coming up. Actually, you have not seen it yet. You have not. I know something you don't know. Uh, you got a you got a good game coming up this uh, this this afternoon at at 1 p.m. Synthetic Legion Rising. I uh, highly recommend you check the video. I don't know how great the commentary is. It's uh, it's a bit of a um, an involved game, so I had to kind of like think. Well, I don't know if I was commentating too much. I have not watched the video back, and I can't really remember if uh, if I felt good about the commentary. Or not. It happened like 30 minutes or 40 minutes ago or something like that. But once I finish recording a video, the the, the memory of it is gone. Um, which is, is funny because uh, one of the one of the viewers I talked to, he'll message me on Discord about comments and stuff, and I'm like, I, I have no idea what you're even talking about. <laughs> it'll, just be, it'll just respond to like a question I said or something. I'm like, I don't even know what you're talking about. Like you have to you have to clarify these things for me because I'm I'm a lot dumber than you might think. I'm a lot smarter than uh, in in some respects, but uh, yeah. Anyway, so. Um, I recorded, I recorded those two. Synthetic Legion Rising was a fantastic game, and we're uh, we're definitely going to be bringing that one in for a, uh, a new series. So that'll be the third series that we add to the channel. That one's not going to be permanent though. That one might be like a uh, one that changed, like a slot that changes frequently. So, like whenever I'm bored of Synthetic Legion Rising, I'll just put another game that I'm not bored of in there. I mean, I'm going to be playing a lot of games with. Uh, with the Amajack try, so I'm going to be finding a lot that I'm I'm interested in. Um, so we might just add a slot in for for that there. Uh, Synthetic Legion Rising, however, is a longer game, um, for sure. So uh, I have to kind of think about how I'm going to plan that into my schedule. But if I'm going to be going for the like the proper schedule and like four hours a day to recording, then that's actually fine. You did. Um, still gotta work that out, but. It is a it is a longer game. The Yamajack tries went on for about 35 minutes, I think, which is the longest Yamajack tries to date, I believe. And uh, it was uh, it was it was a good time. I had a good time with that, so I would definitely want to do that more. Um, it's just a, a matter of finding the time to make that work, because that would be an extra. I don't know. I'm gonna assume that it would be like an hour long for each video 40 40 minutes to an hour long at the, at the start maybe later on we'd be able to bring it down to like 30 to 40 minutes with uh with some practice and just getting better at it um but for now it'd be like an hour long so i'd have to add in like seven hours of recording every week for that which is a lot of time um and i need to make a new thumbnail for that one because that'd be a uh, definitely a, a longer running series um, so, anyway, I gotta, I gotta find somebody to, to buy thumbnails off of, honestly. I've got a couple of friends who do thumbnails or who have experience with it, but, um, I feel bad asking them, even if, even if I'm gonna pay them, because, I don't know, <laughs> either, like, what, what I feel is gonna happen, because we're, like, pretty good friends with, uh, with them. So I feel like what's going to happen is is they're either going to be like, oh, you don't have to pay me. Like, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Or I'm going to be like, no, I'm going to, well, probably both is going to happen. But like, what's going to happen is, is they're, they're going to be like, you don't have to pay me. And I'm going to be like, no, no, I have to pay you. And it's going to be just, it's, I'm either going to pay too much and make them uncomfortable, or I'm going to pay too little and make me uncomfortable. Um, I don't feel like we can find a middle ground there. So asking friends for, for work, because like, it's work. Right? If I was if I was gonna ask a friend for a thumbnail, it's work. I want to pay them for it, right? And they want to get paid for it too. I mean, you don't you don't want to get uh, like do work for free for somebody, especially if it's gonna be 
like commercial, like like what I intend for it to be. Um, you want you want to get paid for it, right? Um, they might be fine doing like a simple thing. Like the thumbnails that I'm currently using were made by uh, by a friend, and I, I paid nothing for them, and I'm okay with that because it was he spent like I don't know 20 minutes or 30 minutes on it, and I'm doing the uh, the majority of the work to the thumbnails, getting the backgrounds and whatnot. Um, but getting like a custom thumbnail made is is a is a big deal. So I'd want to pay for it, and I feel I feel awkward asking friends. I feel awkward paying friends, um, for things, because I like I wouldn't want to be paid if somebody, like if one of my friends needed something, and they often do, they'll need like a regex or, or help with uh, OBS or like making scripts or whatever. Like I'll do it for free. I, I don't I don't mind, um, if I have the time, um, and. Uh, you know, it's like, um, I don't want to get paid for that, like, I wouldn't want to be paid for that. Even if it took me, like, two or three hours to, to help you out, like, I don't want to be paid for that, because you're just a friend. I want to just help you, right? So I feel awkward paying friends, because, like, I wouldn't want to be paid. So I put myself in their shoes, and I'm like, maybe they don't want to be paid either, but then I'm also like, I don't want to not pay you for this work, so I'm like, I don't know. It's just an awkward situation. Anyway, moral of the story is I'm, I'm uh, probably going to try and find somebody to do some thumbnails for me. Somebody, uh, some third party from uh, from my life currently. And uh, see if we can't get some, some thumbnails made up for... I'd like to change all the thumbnails on the channel, honestly. Um, because right now we've got... I like the thumbnails that we have, but I'd like to have more personalized thumbnails. Like the KF2 one, I'd really like it to be definitively KF2. And then I'd like to have like some proper branding and stuff going on. And then the Amajack tries, I'd like to have something a little bit cooler. I mean, the thumbnail for the Amajack tries is honestly fine. Um, but then for any new series I want to start up, I want to have proper thumbnails for those as well. And then it's just a, a whole thing, right? Get another stretch in. Yeah, it's good. It's good stuff. Stretching always feels good when you're tired. And, and you get that stretch and you get those, those goosebumps and that just good feeling throughout you it's good <laughs> anyway that's gonna do it for today thank you for watching remember to like the video if you like it subscribe to see more in the future comment if you have anything to say and i will see you next time uh, bye bye